What a lovely day here in Africa. Oh, Python Regius, haven't you heard the dreadful news? What is it? Our cousin, Python Reticulatus, has died. Gasp. The turnout for dear old cousin Reticulatus isn't nearly what I expected. Well, it's no secret that he wasn't well liked amongst members of the genus club. Oh yes, he's constant boasting about being technically the largest extant snake species didn't make him many friends. This coffin seems rather small, don't you think? He's probably all coiled up. Reticulatus was always trying to save mine. Huh. Yes, he was always very good with that. I was always his favorite. I imagine he'll leave me something expensive. Personally, I am hoping for a nice, subtropical area. That's where our genus does best, you know. Well, we have all those places in Southeast Asia I'm hoping for the Philippines. What are you going to do in the Philippines? You'll get scale rot. You're not made for that environment. So, what? You're going to get it. Maybe. We're the same species, idiot. You get scale rot too. Except I'm stronger than you. I always have been. Gasp. What are you trying to say? I'm better than you. Gasp. I'll stab you right in your labial heat sensing pits. I will bite you using all three rows of my teeth. This informational dialogue doesn't feel forced at all. Shut up. I'll constrict you due to my lack of venom. Well, that's not right. The largest member of the python genus and the largest snake species in the world by length would have a bigger skeleton than this. Concerned about those small fixed facts. That's not characteristic of the python genus. That's right. I was never dead. Gasp. Gasp. I was only three. Most members of the Python genus live for at least a couple of decades. Gasp. Gasp. Then why fake your own death? I fake my own death to evade my tax collector. Whose body is this? My tax collector. Then why fake your own death? For dramatic purposes. That was terrible, Atlas. You're a terrible actor.